What's up loves? It's your door April. So yes, you guys, yes. So this is a hair review um slash bundle review for another vendor on Ally Express. Um I'm going to start making the unit today, so I will keep you guys posted on that. So they sent me a bunch of hair, a bunch of hair. Um their name of their store is a beauty beauty forever beauty forever and i got four bundles of hair um in the length of 222s and 220 inches and a 60 inch closure so beauty forever and this is their virgin hair virgin peruvian hair and it's a deep wave so i guess which once you go from deep wave curly kinky curly body wave loose wave natural wave natural wave to me looks exactly like body wave like they look exactly the same exactly the same thing i just think they rename it something different so you think you get something different when it's all exactly the same stuff even with the origins like how do you really know it's from cambodia how do you really know it's from italy you don't know that i don't remember no italians italians with yakky hair but anyway so this is their peruvian hair double wefted and of course it does look decent on camera because this is the before it does have a nice feel to it i will say that so this is the deep way so this is probably going to come out really nice i'm not really sure what i want to do with this i hate bleaching hair sometimes because it kind of like scares me away from the bleaching because once you put bleach to it it just changes the whole texture of the hair i mean the whole curl pattern the curl pattern is like gone you're like what the heck and you're like wishing you never did it but it's too late you can't go back so I get kind of scared. So that's why I like to use a lot of box dyes when it comes to like any type of curly hair because it just does not take away the curl pattern from it. So that is why I like to use a lot of box dyes, when it, especially when it comes to curly hair. If it's like straight hair or body wave hair, then I have no issue using any type of bleach at all. So for the most part, it looks decent. It does not smell bad or anything like this. This is, they um, gave me their Peruvian. I did ask for something different, but they said, well, this one is better. So I said, okay, well, whatever you think, and we'll sh we shall see. So that is the bundle. There's four of them. Here's the downfall, and the one thing that I'm very disappointed about, and I don't know if I can work with this, is the damn closure. Y'all don't see no reinforced sides. Like, where is that? Where are they? Where is they at? Like, there's no reinforced sides on this. Like, I really don't like closures that don't have the reinforced sides. Um, because for one, they are a lot more work. It's a lot more laying flat. You have to really fight with these things to get them to lay flat. And they just don't really work out that great for me. And then once you sew them, if you have if you're if you're pulling them too taut, then it seems like they rip or they want to rip. So I don't like like the closures like this. Now I will be honest and tell you this looks like a pretty damn big closure. Almost like a frontal no. But it looks really, really like a nice size closure. Um, as far as the knots are in it, the knots are good. So the closure is not bad. It's just that I particularly do not favor closures like this. So in my opinion, I would highly suggest that you ladies never buy any more closures like this. Yeah, this was the first closures that, that came out before the reinforced ones. But once you go to something good, why would you want to go to something half-assed? Um, but yeah, I'm not a big fan of this particular closure at all. So this one will have a fight on his hand. And plus, it's all wrinkled. So what am I supposed to do? Iron the back of it? Oh, I probably could. For the most part, the closure looks decent. But anyway, so let's get on to the second portion of this video, which you guys already know. I will put two, three videos in one just so I can keep your attention. went ahead and finished this unit now I will tell you like I stated I wasn't too pleased with the actual closure because it didn't have the reinforced sides but it worked out it did take me a little more struggle and fight and fight to put it on because it doesn't have the actual um, reinforced sides which makes it a little bit more difficult to lay flat as you guys know I love the combs in my units this is what saves me the headache of having to worry about my wig coming off so I'm going to use my standby camouflage palette, which is from Coastal Scents. This thing is fabulous. There is one by Beauty Treats, which you can get off of iCade House, which is actually the same concept and half the price. I'm going to take my brush here, and this is also from Coastal Scents, and I'm just going to put it where I have the part at on the inner portion. I like to do both inner and outer. 
Okay, my dear, so let's get this wig on and popping. The first thing that I like to do is put on my wig cap. This just ensures a proper fit. No moving around, no shifting, none of that. And I said shifting. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to use my concealer and my favorite Topic Hair Filler Fibers. I love this stuff. You guys have seen me use this in plenty of videos. If you have not, then I suggest you give it a try. It's great for thin hair or hair that needs to be made a little bit thicker to go with your closures or wigs. I already went ahead and of course put in my part in this wig and I'm going to take a little bit of concealer on the outer portion and kind of like blend that in with that little tiny bit of leave out that I have. So the hair is gorgeous, very deep wavy and I thought I would try this Cantu um, Revitalizing Curl, something like that but it's a really great product. I love Cantu. Now I'm going to go ahead and fluff it up. She is long, 22 inches. On me she's long because I'm rather short. So yes you guys, let's get into the finished look of this video and I hope you enjoyed it. Okay guys, so here she goes. She is very, very full. This is the four entire bundles of hair in this unit. You guys know I will put every last inch of hair onto it, but it's a really pretty unit. It washes well. If you guys want to know what I use in my hair, it's only what I use in my curly hair. I use the organic uh, coconut curls quenching. This is, you can either leave this in or rinse it out. I leave it in. It's awesome. Like this stuff is so good for any curly hair. It gives it like the softness and it also helps it to stay frizz free. And it's also, it also helps it to control it and just look so lustrous and it doesn't allow it to look like all dry like you would with regular curly hair so that is the one thing that I use and I highly recommend it and the ends were actually really well it curls really really pretty um for the price for it to be so cheap it actually is some good hair and I will give them that like I told you guys before you just have to shop around on Ally Express there are loads of um, vendors I have had my share of vendors but um, I have come across quite a few on Ally Express that I did reviews for which were not like that great I did have one one where it was the smoking hair um, and I have a video for that where the weave actually caught on fire while bleaching it it like started smoking um, and I've had some that are like great and some that are like better than better than great we really like to do the Ally Express hair a lot because it's more affordable for us ladies on a budget I'm not one to spend like a hundred dollars on a bundle of hair I just re really think that's ridiculous first of all um, especially when these Americanized vendors are getting from the same place so I'm really not one to spend a lot like that you just have to be patient watch reviews look for customer service reviews and things and find the right vendor she's long um, and if it was to be straightened it would be even longer but 22 inches with this length is like fabulous and of course I cannot forget my favorite two products in the whole wide world which is the Aussie instant freeze mousse which I also use the hairspray in as well and topic this is the topic full hair instantly um the hair building fibers i love this stuff it does not come with the spray nozzle it normally comes without but you can buy a kit at like target.com and also sally's beauty sells this i love this stuff i highly recommend getting this if you have like a thinning hairline or you just want your hairline to look a little bit thicker to go with your weave or wig then ladies this is this stuff is like a must have i have it in a dark brown it does come in a range of colors very pretty hair and i will give them that just wasn't a huge fan of the closure but you know what there's a way to work around it and besides the closure other than that the hair is in excellent quality as for shedding um well you know what I put the hair on and then I wash it afterwards so when I did wash it I noticed a little bit of the hair shedding and that may do to be in my own fault because I put the conditioner in and then I start brushing I do kind of brush very abrasive I'm kind of hard with the brushing so that may have been to me um to me but as far as like shedding seriously while I'm making it it has not done that as of yet um it just did it while I was washing it so yeah I will post all their information for you guys below if you have any questions you can always email me and check their Ally Express store out and of course you guys know make sure you rate comment and subscribe and the necklace that I'm actually wearing is from beads.us what I which I um recently posted a inexpensive haul cheapskate haul up 
three dollars their jewelry is like amazing statement pieces they're like 89 cents to three dollars stuff that you will find on regular websites for like 20 30 bucks you can get for like three bucks and it's not cheap they are the exact same items that you would get nothing cheap about them i love them so i will post that information for you guys below so on that note let me know what you think stay diva and delicious. make sure to rate comment and subscribe and thumbs this video up and i will talk to you guys on my next video